Hey, uh, Isaac, for you first, uh, how does it feel to end this losing streak and uh, finally get back into the win column over your guys' state rivals? It feels great, man. It's always great to get a win, um, but especially when we have a streak, you know, that we we're going on, we got tested in a lot of ways mentally. You know, it's just good to um, get back on the other side. And Noah, for you, how much did this game uh, mean for you, uh, not only being your third career game against UW, but obviously playing – uh, against some Seattle native uh, friends and whatnot? Um, it meant a lot. It's always uh, fun to come back home and play basketball. Um, I was just happy we pulled out the win and uh, we're ready to go back and back to Pullman and play some more, get back to get ready. Oregon. We play Oregon next? Yeah, we got to bounce back. We got to handle success. Clinton Clark, go ahead. Hey, this is for uh, both of you guys here. Where would you rank this defensive performance in uh, in terms of Pac-12 games? Um, I mean, I think we played really well defensively. Um, we got a lot of stops. I'll probably – I mean, I don't want to give it a ranking, but I, just, I feel like if we just keep on playing the way we play today, we should uh, get a lot more wins, bring a lot more Ws coming in. Just defense wins everything. I agree. Um in terms of like the ranking, I mean, I just like the way we came out with yeah. energy. We different from other games. We punched them in the mouth first, and um, that helped us a lot. Um, you know, and we just came out with more energy. You see us getting the loose balls faster, and we won the bottom of the board. So um, that was a good win for us. And obviously, you two were really key. But can you both speak to you know how vital the length was inside for you guys today? It seems like obviously Fa, Deshaun, and Vova all had uh, pretty big contributions. Yeah, um, F.A. and Deshaun have been coming along really well lately, um, especially Deshaun. He's young, so um, he got, you know, he has a lot of growing, but they've been playing really well for us, grabbing a lot of boards and, and causing a lot of havoc on the offense, and uh, Coach been telling us to keep on pounding the ball in, and, and good things been happening. So that's what we need to continue to do. And obviously being a Pacific Northwest guys for you too, breaking the skid here, you know, couldn't have come at a more perfect time than against Washington, right? Correct. You got it. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Any other questions for uh, Noah and Isaac? Uh, Brenna, go ahead. Noah, is it um, safe to say that this game brings out maybe the more spicy version of yourself uh, every year? For sure, 100%. Um, I mean, especially playing in Seattle, you know, you just get your flavor back when you come back home. You know, you played on these hoops all your life, um, grew up in this gym. So it's just, it's just a good feeling. Yes, it's a little more chippy every time you come play against UW. Overall in your career, 3-0 and against UW, 2-0 uh, and in Seattle. Just, just how does that feel for you personally as well? It feels amazing. Um, I, feel like, I feel like we're unbeatable against the dogs. We got the secret formula. Uh, Theo Lawson, go ahead. Yeah, for Isaac. Um, How would you guys kind of balance the, the, the emotions of coming to a game against uh, UW and, and still kind of playing within yourselves and, and doing everything that you guys need to do to, 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 to win a basketball game? How do you kind of balance those, those two things? I um, mean, I think just going inside first, establishing our bigs. Um, Deshaun's been, you know, coming along in that way. And uh, we just came in with the right attitude today. I feel like um, one thing about us is, you know, each game we go into, it doesn't seem like we lost, you know, um, we're on a losing streak at all. And I felt like that was another game today. And um, things just clicked for us a little bit more. And, um, you know, that was, that was just a positive note to go into these Oregon games. It seemed like you guys could really open up the game once once a few th uh, three-pointers started falling because you guys obviously had, had, had no threes at halftime and then started making a few and eventually got it to a 20-point lead in the second half. For sure. The road teams need threes. That's what our coach tells us. So, right. What was the mood in the locker room like after you guys got, got back in there after winning the game? It was nothing but high energy. Um, everybody's excited that we got our, our, you know, back, got back winning and, you know, got out of that streak, that little funk we had. So uh, we got to handle success and go out to Oregon and try to do the same thing.